Good evening, Pre-K. We're going to read a story to put you to sleep tonight. It's called Rise the Moon. It's by Eileen Spinelli, and the illustrations of the pictures are by Raul, Raul Cologne. I like the beginning of this book because it shows us the different phases of the moon. There's a full moon, a crescent moon, a gibbous moon. Rise the moon. Rise the moon and lunar moth, dawn to its lovely shine, flits across the blossoms of the dreary moonflower vine. While in a rooftop attic in the quiet hush of night, a moonlit artist takes his brush to paint a bowl of light. A downstairs dancer climbs up to the dappled roof alone to do a graceful moon dance on her neighbor's garden stone. This page has no words. A night shift baker rolls a moon-shaped crust for an apple pie as Mooney Tomcat yowls atop an alley fence nearby. Did you find the cat? Right there. You see the moon again. And oh, the sleepy sailor on the swaying schooner knows it is the pool of moon by which the ocean comes and goes. Another page with no words. This shows us the sailor and the moon. And some fish. Sea turtles launch themselves across a breezy dune towards the surf that's speckled golden by the midnight moon. Oh, I like this one. Remember that book we read with the turtles that needed to get to the ocean? That's what this page reminds me of. Esperanza. The silver wolf is called to howl its ancient moonstruck song. Others in the pack join in a haunting sing-along. Another wordless page that the wolves are howling at the moon. The cozy camper reads by moonlight and a tired hiker sees a welcome path of moonbeams through the darkened trees. Astronomers star party on the soaring mountain slopes to watch the distant moon faces through the skyward telescopes. Ooh, looks like a mouse. Moon wakened mouse goes gathering so busy and so brave while bat wakens upside down and flutters from her cave. You see the bat? Right there. Oh, and the moon has a fun smiley face. Some farmers follow faithfully this old advice indeed that moonrise is the wisest time for planting pumpkin seed. Young mother swings by moon glow beneath the leafy boughs while baby dreams of mother goose and moons and jumping cows. So rise the moon so round and bright 
let its tender night magic fall. Within its spell of splendor, we are moon-hearted creatures all. I'm looking out my window. I don't see the moon tonight. But if you do, check out what kind of moon is it. Is it a full moon? Is it a crescent moon? Is it the new moon? Is it an old moon? Is it the half moon? Check it out. Have a great night, guys. See you soon.